she had a left-sided hearing loss from a cholesteatoma and we haven't talked about a cholesteatoma yet but it's it's really generally a benign growth that forms in the middle ear space in that tym tympanic cavity um, and so it just starts to grow 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 and of course its growth impacts the movement of the middle ear bones and sometimes that cholesteatoma can start to push on the eardrum and potentially even rupture through the eardrum depending on how quickly that it's growing so because of this barbara had that cholesteatoma removed oftentimes when they remove the cholesteatoma they also complete an additional surgery called a mastoidectomy where they actually go in and remove a lot of the cells and space around the tympanic cavity because of infection and things that have been spurred from the growth of this cholesteatoma so um we have a picture of what her normal right-sided ear canal is going to look like. Okay, again, beautiful, great. Um, however, on the left-hand side, we're working with a completely different dynamic here. So there's the picture of what it looks like on that left-hand side. So you can visualize in the bottom left-hand corner, there is a very small, what looks to be tympanic membrane uh, eardrum. And then you have just these really large spaces up at the top there, kind of like an, the, the attic of, of that tympanic cavity that have been removed surgically as well. So that tells me straight from the jump, we are probably going to see at minimum some conductive hearing loss from this, um, but we may also see some more sensory neural hearing loss from this as well. Absolutely, yeah, because again, anytime that you uh, take away from the natural pathway of sound moving through the outer ear and into the middle ear, you're going to potentially have some hearing loss that's caused by that even after you've gone through the medical procedure to address the problem, which in this case for her, for Barbara, was the cholesteatoma that had to be removed. Right. 